randomly did these well not today but yesterday i randomly did these twists in my head i am just gonna show you what happened you know because it was very spur of the moment easier than you know when i did the twist the uh the knotless that was a disaster to say the least now it's gonna start after I did a few because I was debating back and forth on if I was gonna record anyway, but I've come to the realization that don't doubt, just record. Like whenever I, I be like, think even if I just, if I even have a think about, like a thought about recording, I'm just gonna do it because yeah. But yeah, enjoy the video and like, share, subscribe, and comment. Thanks. What up? So this, like I said, was very spur of the moment. I the ne the previous day I spent the I spent the night with one of my best friends and we were just talking about it and I was up thinking about it all night like all last night like all the night before basically so I just had to do it whenever I can't get something out my head I have to do it that's just how I work I don't know if anybody else like that but that's just me once I get an idea I gotta do it so the only problem I had and the only mistake I made once again is I ran out of shining jam now I guess it kind of was a good thing because I do plan on trying a different one the next time I do these twists because I think these are going to be a rotating style just because I'm trying to grow my hair out while it's break, basically breaking and I love a good protective style especially for the summertime it's, it's lit it's litty it's litty in the city okay so this is not a tutorial, but I'm just basically showing you what was going on. So they told me, well, all the, cause this is like viral on TikTok too. So basically they braid the hair first just to secure, because if you start off with a twist, it's going to unravel and it ain't going to be right. So it starts off with a braid, you braid like four or five times, and then you just twist all the way down, twist the rest of the way down. But I had to braid mine kind of like almost damn near an inch down for me because my hair is just, and it, it, it's still some some twist that I had to fix just because my hair kept, because I didn't have enough shiny jam. Like, like I said, the next term, I I know these will be a lot more, I guess, cleaner. Yeah. I think it'll be a lot more cleaner the next time I do it just because I'm going to get the big thing of shiny jam. And I want to try a different one. I want to try the red container shiny jam because I think that's specifically for stuff like this. But the yellow one worked too. But I don't even know why I thought I was gonna be able to do that with the little, with that little thing of shiny jam. It just didn't. It wasn't working. Okay. So yeah, I just now there was because it was. I seen a different. I've seen different tutorials where some people actually they did like free parts where basically they didn't part it at all. But as you can see, my parts ain't that. You know, they kind of clean. For like this at least for the stuff that I, I was able to reach you know as far as my hair go but my my parts like especially in the front where I, anywhere where i could see pretty much is gonna be clean now the back i think it's still it's fairly clean too but uh not as, not as clean as the front because obviously because i can see it but it still came out nice you know i'm still gonna rock them i always rock my work except this work is gonna be rocked a lot longer than the knotless braids because i took them out I, I i kept them in the full day after i did them and then i took them out that night because no absolutely not they were they were i didn't like them i did not like them but these i can get jiggy with when i seen how easy it was for everybody else to do it i said oh, okay i could do that you just find the hair that worked for you. Now, the only thing is I didn't use the hair that everybody else used. So, I put that at the bottom. I used the Aloha Twist hair by Model Model because that's what I could find in, like, while I was looking. You know what I'm saying? So, that's to use what you can find, really. As long as it's some twist hair, I feel like you should be all right. And you just braid and keep twisting until you're done. I love this style. I really do. I really, really do. And I only needed, I really only needed one pack and a little bit out of the second pack. Like I ran out of hair on like the last, like maybe three, last three twists maybe is when I ran out of hair. I always buy two just to be safe, even though the Aloha twist hair I got is say three times. So that means it got a lot more hair in it. Is it? And it really do. It got, it had a lot of hair. 
like a lot, a lot of hair in it. That's why I was surprised I actually ran out. But it's fine. That's why I buy two. At the most, when the hair with a hairstyle like this, two suffices. And I didn't want nothing too long, cause in the hairstyle I was in, they had like they definitely had different. They diff had different lengths, and I didn't want. I knew I didn't want nothing long for sure. I don't want nothing long. Because when it comes to sleep, I don't want nothing heavy on my head. And these are super lightweight. Super duper lightweight, bro. I love it. I love it. I, I think that's kind of why I don't like not this braids too much. And why I was so eager to jump on these. Because not this braids definitely be too heavy on your head, on the top. And I don't like that for me. I do not. I do not. I love a good protective style, but I don't like no heavy style. That ain't the way I like to do it, you know? But yeah. It's gonna be different. Basically, basically it's gonna be different clips as I am as I continue to do this. It's definitely gonna be some different clips because I get to different, point, different parts of my head eventually. So of course, this ain't the whole, whole video. But I'm gonna just keep coming back to you when I got different parts of my hair done i was jamming my song was playing this is the part of the part of the part of the break of the twisting where i was listening to my music i was listening to music i was i didn't look at i wasn't looking at no t tutorials or nothing because i couldn't even hardly see the tv from where i was at so i just figured i would click on something put the tv put the youtube on something that i could hear and I could see from, kind of see from a, I don't know. I didn't want to put nothing too crazy on. I didn't want nothing new on. I didn't put those shows on. Because like I said, for where I was sitting, I could not see, I couldn't see the TV clearly. Because I can't, I'm blind, you know? I am not. I am, is it farsighted? Nearsighted. I could see close to me. I can't see far. Like, real far, it looked blurry. So that far sided <laughs> either way that's what i am without my glasses i can't see much of nothing past everything in my face you know or in my reach but yeah i guess i'll just let you um i'll be back okay i'm gonna let this i'm gonna be back when we get to when we get a little further, okay? When we get, like, to the back, we just gonna keep doing this. And I'm gonna just keep showing you what I'm doing until... Because as you can see, I'm, I'm getting done, you know? I did have to stop. I ain't gonna lie. I did have to stop. And because at this, at this particular day was also Father's Day. So I had to cook some, too. So I chose... For bay, I chose a Mississippi pot roast, which that recipe will go up this week also, if not tomorrow. Either way, I'm gonna get it up. It's gonna be up this week, probably more than likely tomorrow. I'm gonna put the video up. I just wanted to make sure I got this one up for sure, because like I said, whenever I think about not recording, is when I regret not recording. <laughs> So whenever I just doubt it, I just do it. You know what I'm saying? If I ever have any doubts about anything, I just do it. You know? Like I said, this really ain't no tutorial. I'm just kind of showing you what I did. This is not like just my cooking videos. Which, speaking of that, I don't just cook, as you can see. I am very into, like, switching up my hair. I'm, I'm, I'm all into that. You know what I'm saying? I'm all into that. Because I, I constantly, I feel like I just need something done to my hair. Like, right now, while it's growing, protective styles are my bestie. Okay? And ain't nothing wrong with that. Because it's, it's, like I said, it's getting hot. Summertime is for protective styles. If you like to wear your hair out, that's cool. But the humidity is not finna get me. Okay? We ain't got time for that. We ain't got time. But before I started cooking... I actually, that was one of the things I was into. I was into doing hair before I was cooking. Like, in the sew-in days, when I was in my, like when I was a teenager, I used to do my friend's sew-ins because I know how to braid, obviously, because I know how to braid, too. So, I used to do their sew-ins. I used to do their hair. I used to do my own hair. Definitely used to do the 
I used to do, I, listen, I used to slay my hair for show, like for show, for show. It was so, styles back then used to be easy. As long as you can braid, you can do anything, I feel like. Once you can braid, just do a basic braid, you can do anything. Like, that's just what it is. Except, I don't like braiding. I knew I didn't want to do hair, and that's why I stopped, because it is tough on the hands. And even when I'm braiding my own hair to the back, it cr they, they cramp up. You know? I don't like that. My hands get real cramped up if I'm braiding for too long. Now, if I'm now twisting, this a whole nother, this, this another ball game. And I was actually sitting down, because any other time I did my hair, I wasn't sitting down. But... This wasn't that bad on the hair. Even when I had to, like, get to the top of my head, this wasn't bad on the hands, you know? But, you know, I, I knew I didn't want to be a hairstylist for sure because I need my hands. And, I, I you know, I'm, I'm creative in a lot of different ways. So I like to do hair my own. I, like, I love cooking, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of things I, I like to do. I like to shop. I ain't even going to lie. I like to grocery shop. <laughs> but I'm not a normal grocery shopper because I'm like a speed shopper. I'm going to get in and out, okay? I say 20 minutes tops if, if I know what I'm looking for. If I'm, if I'm, basically, if I know if I'm go, what I'm going for, it's going to be maybe 20 minutes tops. But, you know, I got a hand in a bunch of different things. I've always been told since I was younger that I had blessed hands. And I can't disagree with that. I cannot, because everything my hands touch, magic, baby. It's magic. See? Now, this could have been done in, i say, four, four to six hours. Tops. This could have been done in, the, in that amount of time. But since I was spurred the moment, I just got off the highway. I had to go to the hair store and find some hair, which took, like, ten minutes. And then... I had to stop because I had to go get some last minute things to cook for the uh, Mississippi pot rolls. It was a lot. So once I got done, of course I had to moose it and I had to go get moose. So that's another reason I had to stop. So this took longer than expected. Maybe like from like two, about two to 11. I ain't gonna lie about two to 11. Yeah, about two to 11, almost, almost 10. But that, like I said, that's with stops, though. Without stops, this can definitely be done, of course, within a day. I finished it within a day. So, And I was seeing people saying they, they took them like three days. Uh-uh. Who's going to take three days? Who's going to take two days? I know I was finishing this tonight because whatever I start, I'm finishing. We don't, we're not doing that. And look at that. Cute. Super cute. Super cute. Makes, I hope you like this video. I really do. Make sure you drop a comment. Make sure you like, subscribe, share. You know, cause this is easy. This is easy. I just like making videos and I like, I just like doing stuff for the camera so y'all can see how talented I am. Cause I, I can do this. I can do stuff. I like DIYs. Mm -hmm. As usual, I will have my Instagram boom right here. Go follow. We growing 10K. We on the way, baby.